Hello guys, welcome back to another video from the Webs Family 5. Today we are going to be trimming some trees, so I'm going to show you the tools that we're going to need. So I'm going to use one of this big pole with a saw on the end, as you can see right there. And then also right in here, once you pull the rope, a little thing of metal will come, and that can cut smaller branches. So I'm going to use this, I'm going to set this down. And then I'm going to use this thing right here, also for cutting little branches that are down lower, and so you can do it easier without using that huge thing and trying to get an aim. It's a lot easier. And then I'm going to want to use one of these right here. This is a handheld one that I can take the lock off and it'll come out spring loaded. Really nice, and then I can cut branches with this. Alright, so we're gonna head out to the tree that we are gonna be trimming. So now that we've finished trimming our tree, as you can see right there, we're going to go through with our snip, both of our snippers and cut off the little branches on the side and a couple that are just hanging down that I don't want to cut off the rest of the branch on. Alright, so I'm just going to go grab a ladder so I can reach up to some of the spots. So now that that is finished, I trimmed a couple more branches in there. The tree looks pretty good. It's got a couple spots where it's just a little lower. But otherwise, yeah, it's pretty cool. So now what I'm going to do is try and grab a couple more sticks that are in there. They're dead and been there for a while. Then I'm going to remove this big pile of all the branches I cut out into our garden, which will burn them later um later this season and we'll make a youtube video on that all right so let's move the branches all right so we're gonna make a bit of a sled here i've done part of it as you just saw so we're gonna lay two branches down and we're also gonna lay a third this is gonna help us be able to move it easier and in less trips it might be harder to move it, but it'll be less time consuming. And I would have stopped throwing branches on the top of this. And that's all that was really to it. Alright, so as you can see, I got some help from my dad. He's gonna help me tow all the stuff over to yeah, our the garden. Job will get done. So we're just gonna go over here. And then head over to a pile, which is from, there's some stuff from our other river birch tree that I trimmed yesterday, which is right here, which also turned out fabulous. And so we're gonna move that over there. So we got it here in the garden. And Me. you got it here then. 
Cute. And we're just going to start throwing and to the top of this pile. I don't want it going any further that way. Okay. So let's put it this way. We're gonna head back over here and get another load. Alright, so we got our last load here from bringing the tree, on um, trimming the tree. And we're just gonna bring this into the garden up here. Which, so far, out of two river birch trees that we have trimmed, we've got three more yet. We have this a ton of branches and leaves here so we're gonna have a pretty big fire once we decide to burn all this all right so let's go check out the tree all right here's our finished part um product right now from right over here down in a little ditch and it looks a lot better than it did as you saw from the starting so now we're just going to clean up our tools and head inside. So thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.